Hello everyone, welcome in my channel ASP.NET Core. Today I am going to show you display and upload image in ASP.NET Core 3.0 and uh, 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 higher version. So first thing you can do uh, changes in the model that is uh, add a string type property that is the profile image and uh, remaining all the things are uh, same like uh, DB context and uh, uh, application settings that connection string file and uh, startup.cs file the everything is same and after that uh, you have to add migration uh, into your project and update database with the new property uh, that is uh, a profile image now after that you can make a new view model for your uh, image uh, how to upload it so first thing you can do uh, that is uh, add a new file tag helper into your project so if you are adding ta a file tag helper then must to use iform file in your view model so here we have uh, id name and the profile image as a string type but notice that the profile image in the view model is the iform file so just again um, open your uh, view model uh, here we have iform file as a profile image okay so the next thing you can do uh, in a controller section so the in, in the index uh, method must to add or must to get all the uh, images all the records from the database table so uh, use a D, uh, data context file uh, that is application db context and add that a db context in uh, as a property as well as initialize it in the constructor so just add private read only application db context context and using context you got all the uh, entries or you can say all the records from the database table that is from the student tables you can say and uh, send the items in the index now after that uh, you uh, you have to create uh, you have to uh, add a create method uh, in a controller and generate view uh, respective uh, controller that is add and also select a model that is the uh, student view model okay and add a new tag helper which is related to the iform file so the uh, label is not uh, required but uh, in asp.net core uh, uh, input asp4 is iform file so that is the profile image and uh, validations for also the iPhone file that is pr profile image profile image so you, you can also add in the label so that thing you can add okay <coughs> so when we click on the uh, uh, button that is the submit button uh, or you can say the create button then image will be loaded into the upload folder as well as database uh, uh, table so that uh, change in the uh, class file that is form control is enough uh, you also uh, and uh, also add a new HTTP post create method in the post create method we got a student view model uh, that is VM and uh, also add a form uh, attribute that is NCT uh, NCT type that is multi part from data okay that's fine in the view section and just if you got a multiple file here just add iPhone file is only only the single file I want to add in the project folder so string uh, the file name uh, first of all uh, got, got the file name from your VM so upload file here is a method and uh, add a new uh, object for the student class in which you can pass the name and the profile image and the profile image in the model that is the string type so you can add string file name okay now after that you uh, make some changes in the database table uh, like save changes as a record so context dot um, 
students dot add student and uh, save changes context dot uh, save changes return redirect to return uh, on the index page that is an index page and uh, in 3.0 uh, make some changes in a 2.0 uh, in ESP.NET Core that is related to your uh, iWeb host environment as well as the iHosting environment. iWeb hosting environment is the similar to the iHosting environment but uh, some changes uh, so in 3.0 and 3. Uh, in the latter session uh, always use iWeb host environment uh, instead of iHosting environment. So first of all uh, got a directory that is by using the iweb host environment so uh, add it here uh, iweb host environment web host environment Actually, iWeb host environment is not uh, there uh, in a so resolved it by using iWeb host environment initialized it in the constructor as well as make a property uh, in your class that is web host environment uh, of the iWeb host environment. So path dot combine and in which you can add that is the string path one and path two that is the path one is the web host environment dot web root path web root path and uh, the second string is related to the folder name of uh, inside your ww root folder that is the images so add images that's fine now after that you got a, a single string so name of the string you can say the file name is uh, guid dot new guid and uh, dot two string separated by the underscore and uh, file name vm dot profile image dot file name that's fine now after that you got a new thing that is the uh, uh, file path so path dot combine the directory that is the upload dir and the file name that is the path of the file and you can use a file stream to save the file uh, into your directory so first of all where file file stream equals to new file stream and here you can use file path and file mode dot create vm dot profile image dot copy to on that path set so that is the file that hold the file stream that's fine now after that you can return your file that is the file name just i want to uh, return as a string type that is uh, use a file name in the database table only because in the model we have a string type of name of the file the name of the file is the file name so resolved it and you have to check on the index page just add a new view and select the model that is original model uh, model of the class not a view model and change that uh, razor syntax uh, in the form of tag helper src is images tiled symbol images and the name of the file that is exist in the database table so you got from the item 
so item dot profile image and uh, uh, class is related to the circle uh, rounded circle and the width and the height is the 40 40 and uh, uh, ASP append version is true ASP append version true that's fine now you you have to see your output so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to uh, display and upload images and related to any query please comment it and don't forget please subscribe my channel if you like this video please subscribe uh, my channel and also like this video thank you very much for watching this video